welcome back to my channel. I'm about to pick out an outfit for Pilates. I'm kind of in a rush, so I'm gonna do that while I talk to you guys. I have to leave in like nine minutes. I'm going with this set from Set Active, these cute leggings. You guys, I'm so excited for summer because I want to wear cute little workout sets. And this is like cute and stuff, but I can't wait until I can wear like shorts or my little like one pieces. I always throw a t-shirt over my sets because I feel uncomfy wearing just like the bra and the leggings. I'm gonna change really quick. Okay, set is on. Now let's fix my hair and do some makeup. Makeup is kind of a strong word because all I ever do for Pilates is put on this under eye brightener. Oh, this is by Rare Beauty. I have always been a bit insecure about how like red my under eyes and just like the whole area around my eyes is. So I like to just throw this on. Not that it even matters or that anyone cares. I'm gonna brush through my eyebrows with a gel and I'm just gonna curl my lashes because why not? It always makes me feel so much better when my eyelashes are curled. Also, don't mind my messy room. Today is a cleaning day. I'm also trying to wash my sheets right now, but there's someone doing laundry. Okay, face is fine. I'm gonna throw on a lip mask. I always slick back my hair in the lowest pony I possibly can. All right, I just spilled something on my pants, so I had to change them. I just threw on some black yoga pants. But yeah, I always just do a low pony because you have to like lay down and it's really uncomfortable when your ponytail is like any high. I usually do it better than this, but we don't have time today. I feel like I'm never rushing in any of my videos. Cause if I am, I just won't film, but today we're doing it. The rest of the day will be more relaxing than this, I promise. I always have to clip my bangs back too. I kind of didn't do a very good job. I'm gonna throw on the t-shirt, throw on my little Pilates socks and head out. Okay, we're in the car. I have my first higher level class today. It's just one level up from what I usually do, but I am nervous because the instructor that I've been going to recently has been just like challenging me more than other instructors have. And I have her for the even more challenging like level class. So I'm nervous. Okay guys, we are in the Starbucks drive-thru. I want to try a drink that I saw on the Starbucks app and also my friend from class recommended it to me and he said it tastes just like chocolate covered strawberries. So we're gonna test that out today. Hi, can I get a grande pink drink with light ice, no strawberries and chocolate cold foam? Also the Pilates class went well. It wasn't as hard as I thought it was gonna be, honestly. It was definitely challenging though and more challenging than usual, but I was expecting to be like dead afterwards, but I really enjoyed it. And I'm gonna keep doing that level of class I'm so tired right now. I don't know how much caffeine the pink drink has. Honestly, I don't even know if I'm gonna like this because I usually don't like the pink drink, but we're gonna try it anyways. I feel like the chocolate foam is going to help with that. And I'm honestly craving chocolate covered strawberries right now for some reason. So this is like the perfect drink. Thank you. Have a good one. You too. All right, drink is secured. Looks gorgeous. Okay, I'm back home ready to try the drink and I'm so sad because it lost all of its pink on the drive home, but we're gonna try it. Tastes like bubble gum. I don't know how I feel about it. I think it's good. If you like the pink drink and you like chocolate, you'll love this. Like it's a good drink. I just don't know if I'd ever get it again. I also got a cake pop because why not? I was also able to put my sheets in the washer when I came up. So those will be done in like an hour. Before I shower, I'm gonna clean the apartment because I always get so like hot whenever I clean. So I'm gonna do that first. I'm pretty much gonna clean the entire apartment. So I don't know how long that's gonna take. Usually I throw on my headphones and put on like a podcast or something. It is 1.25. Let's see if I can be done by the time my laundry is finished. I just moved my stuff to the dryer. I finished all the cleaning except for the floors. So I'm gonna go around and vacuum and mop. The floors are bad right now, like everywhere in the house. I feel like we've both just been busy recently and so cleaning has not been as big of a priority. But since I have like a free day today, I'm able to just like clean up and stuff and the floors are just really bad, especially in the kitchen because the floors are white. It's easy to see when there's dirt built up and then like <laughs> there's just hair everywhere because we're two girls with dark hair who apparently shed a lot. <laughs> So I am going to clean the floors really quick. I forgot 
have to record a lot of myself doing the floors but they look a lot better and vacuuming is just so satisfying i am like exhausted right now i don't know if it's the cleaning or pilates or both i also stayed up a bit later than usual last night i'm just so tired so i'm gonna go take a shower i just feel gross i want to just get clean i want to get cute as much as i shouldn't care and i know that you guys probably don't care or judge me at all i hate filming when i look like this hate is maybe too strong of a word but it's just like obviously i would prefer to like feel cute and confident but yeah i'm gonna go shower i'm gonna wash my hair and i'll talk to you guys in a bit Okay, I'm all showered. I think my sheets are done, but before I go grab those, I need to make myself a coffee. I don't know why I'm so tired. I'm kind of thinking that it's because this is the first day that I've really had that is just completely free. No homework to be like working on or anything like that. I have stuff to look forward to for this weekend. Like I'm doing good right now. And I'm wondering if that's why I'm so tired because subconsciously I just am relaxing, like genuinely relaxing for the first time in a bit. The point is I am grateful to be feeling good today and I'm tired, but but like whatever mentally i'm fine my body is just like wanting to go to sleep right now but i still have a couple things left to do today and so i'm going to wake myself up go grab my sheets and then get ready Just blow dried my hair. I'm gonna put it back for a minute while I get ready. I am gonna do like the most simple makeup. Cause the day's already like halfway over and I'm not even really doing much for the rest of the day. So I am just going to quickly do some natural makeup. Done. I randomly decided to change tank tops because I think I want to wear this one later, but I'm about to do my hair I wanted to show you guys how I've been curling it recently. I have been using the beach waver It's a ceramic rotating curling iron So it rotates and does all the work for you and you control it This is like the easiest way I've found to curl my hair If you struggle with using the curling irons with clamps like I do This is great for you because this is so easy to use. The ceramic rod protects your hair You can adjust the heat So I'm just gonna take a section clamp the end of the hair into it and then press the little arrow going away from my face just depending on whichever way you want the curls to be and I just hold it for a few seconds I really like that it can like curl the ends because you can't really do that with the curling one so it just depends on the look you want obviously but I have been really into curling the ends recently because I feel like it gives you that like rollers look if that makes sense but yeah so you would just hold down the arrow you want and then when you release it stops I was nervous to use it at first but it is actually like the easiest thing ever I just realized I totally forgot about heat protectant they have this great barrier heat protectant hairspray. I'm just gonna spray this on the rest of my hair. Totally forgot to do this. Okay, I finished curling this side. I'm gonna do the other side and let these sit and cool down before I brush through. Okay, both sides are now curled. I'm gonna spray the hairspray on my brush while I brush through them to like distribute the product, I guess. I just like brushing through my curls because I prefer them to be like big waves rather than tighter curls. Okay, it already looks so good. Like this is so pretty. Anyway, something I like to do after brushing through everything is just grab some of like the top layers and curl through them again and really like go all the way up to the very top to get like as much volume as I can. And I'll just go through and make sure I didn't like miss any pieces or anything like that. I especially like going in and taking really small pieces from the top and recurling them because I feel like when you kind of like shake it out, it looks like you did so much more work than you actually did. So I'm gonna do a few pieces over here and then I will show you guys. Like, are we serious right now? It looks so good. This is like the most voluminous my hair has ever been. I'm so happy. They also have a dry shampoo. I like to spray this on my hair at night and then not even really rub it in. And then in the morning, it soaks in all by itself and it looks like you have like freshly washed hair, but you don't. Your hair just feels clean, which is so nice. So that is how I've been doing my hair recently. I am obsessed. The beach waver is amazing. Okay, I need to run to the grocery store before it gets too late. So I am going to throw on probably just some jeans and a jacket. Okay.
Okay, here's the fit. Tank top is Brandy. Jacket is Princess Polly. Jeans are cotton on, and then I'm wearing my docks. I think this jacket looks so cute with just like the top button like this. I saw the model on the website wearing a very similar outfit to this, so that's kind of where I got the inspo. I've been loving getting ready every day, even if I'm not doing anything. I like just putting on an outfit, doing some light makeup. It just makes me feel a lot better. I don't know. I've noticed a huge difference mentally ever since I started just like getting ready instead of just like staying in my PJs all day, which is also fine. But I find a lot of joy in getting ready. So it's more of just like a fun thing to do. Almost like a little way to treat myself every day. So if you have a lot of days where you are just kind of sitting at home, maybe you work from home and don't necessarily need to get dressed, I recommend just trying it out, doing it anyways. It makes me feel so good. So it's a little bit later in the day. I want to run to the grocery store before it gets dark. So let's go. Do a quick haul. I got some new flowers. I have this mason jar pitcher from JCPenney that I use as a flower base for the kitchen table and it's so cute. So I'm gonna put those in there. I got some frozen pizzas, got some bananas. I got these little strawberry smoothies. If you haven't tried these, these are so good. I like bringing these for my drive to school because it's just like quick and easy. I got some lettuce, some milk. I got a protein bar and then some strawberries and then this little pack of Oh my god, of brownies. I love brownies and strawberries with vanilla ice cream, so I am gonna have to have some of that tonight. But there was one thing that I went to the store for that they did not have, and that was eggs. And I'm so sad about it because I wanted to bake tonight. That was kind of the whole reason I wanted to go to Trader Joe's, but honestly, I'm still so tired. So no baking tonight, but I'm not that mad about it because then I can just have a normal relaxing night, not really do much, probably just watch TV and stuff, maybe edit a bit. But I'm gonna put all these groceries away and make something for dinner. I don't know what yet. I don't feel like making anything. I don't know, I'll figure it out. I'm gonna watch a movie. I've wanted to watch Pretty Woman for a while, so I'm excited to just like relax, not really do anything. Probably gonna have some popcorn. I think I'm gonna change into some sweatpants because jeans aren't always the most comfortable thing, but I love nights like this where you kind of just have nothing to do, but in a good way, especially after being burnt out. <laughs> 